Hi, I'm Susan with Mommy High Five, and I am reviewing the Gab Watch 3. We have used the Gab Watch and the Gab Watch 2, so we were excited to buy the Gab Watch 3 when it came out a couple weeks ago, and we have been using it ever since. So the Gab Watch 3 is a safe kids watch phone that allows kids to call and text but only to a white list of contacts, meaning the parents have to approve any number that the kids call or any number that calls them or texts. Uh, this version of the watch allows up to 100 contacts, which kids really like. Um, typically, this watch is good for kids from about four to maybe up to 10, depending on the kid. This watch has unlimited talk and text, which is great for young kids. Sometimes they get a little carried away. Uh, there is an SOS option with this watch phone, which means if the kids need, need you in an emergency, they hold down on the top button for 10 seconds and it will automatically call whoever you have set up to be their SOS, which typically is a parent or guardian. This watch cannot call 911 but you can set up a contact for your local police station uh, in case they need to get a hold of the police department. So one great thing about this uh, watch that others don't have is a speech to text and a keyboard. So your kid can type or speak whatever message they want to send to you and text that to you. For younger kids, there are preset text messages that parents can choose to use or not to use. Uh, the Gab Watch 3 comes with 12 preset text messages and those are things like, I'm home, when will you be home? Uh, it's got a, a variety of different messages. If you want to add or delete any of those, you can uh, for up to 20 preset text messages. One of the best things about the Gab Watch 3 is the GPS option that is on there. So you can go into your MyGab parent app and click locate and it will show you where your child is, where your child's watch is. Um, and the child can also go on their watch and swipe down from the top and hit the locate button to kind of check in with you to show you where they are. Gab has the option to set up safe zones. So if you decide that you want to know when your child leaves home or gets home, you can set it up to alert you when either of those things happen. You can also set it up for school so that you know when your child arrives at school or leaves school. Uh, you can set up other safe zones as you feel uh, it's necessary. Uh, one feature that kids like is the Gab Go, which has been uh, on, on the Gab Watch 2 as well. It's a game where the kids choose a pet. Uh, parents go into the parent uh, app and they can set tasks for the kids to do. So maybe it's making your bed, reading for 30 minutes. You set up which days that you want them to do those tasks. They go on their watch to the Gab Go app and they can see what their tasks are. Once they are finished with their task, they hit the check mark and you get a notification saying that they finished the task. Then you go in and approve it and then that gives them coins that they can use to buy items for their pet, buy them accessories or clothing, uh, they can feed their pet, they can uh, buy actions for their pet, they can teach their dog to roll over or um, play dead, those kinds of things. So for especially for the younger kids, that's something that they really love. Uh, there's also the Gab Move app, which is new for the Gab Watch 3. It basically keeps track of steps and movement so the kids can go in there and choose some sort of physical activity. There are 12 activities that are preset in there and there are things like swimming, biking, walking, hiking, uh, playing basketball. 
There are 12 preset activities that you can go in and you push start that you're starting the activity. It'll keep track of how long you've gone and it'll keep track of distance. You can also um, set up for it to keep track of how many laps you've gone. Um, there's also an other category so that if the specific activity your child is not doing or is doing is not listed, they can add that in the other category. Um, kids are also loving the new Mimic game on the Gabwatch 3. And that is a game that has, uh, on, on their watch, it has four different shapes with different colors. And the watch will light up one of the shapes and then they'll have to hit that shape. And then with each round, there are more um, there are more shapes chosen in a specific sequence and, and the kids have to remember what the sequence is and hit the buttons in the right sequence um, in order to get points and they're really liking that a lot. So parents are loving that they can contact their kids with this watch. Their kids can contact them whenever they need. There are also modes that parents can set to keep their kids off the phone during school time. Uh, there's a silent mode that just silences the uh, notifications and there's also focus mode which disables any calling or texting except to parents and it also uh, disables any of the fun apps that are on there during the time that they are in school or whenever the parents set up that they want that to happen. Um, and all of that is done in the parent app, so if you decide that you want to change that at any time, it's really easy and quick to do. Uh, you can also set up nighttime hours where the kids can't use it um, at night. So let's talk about some of the new things with the Gabwatch 3 compared to Gabwatch 2. One of the things that we're loving the most is the new charger. The old charger had prongs that you had to line up on the back of the watch and a lot of times if there was any sort of dirt or grime or sweat or anything in the back of the watch, it was really hard to get it to line up right and charge. The parents were having to dig out their, the dirt from the back of the watch and it, it just was not a, a fun process if you couldn't get that watch to charge. So this Gab Watch 3 is completely smooth on the back. It has a wireless charger like you would have with a smart watch for an adult, uh, an Apple watch or something, where it just sits right on top of the charger and charges without a problem. This version of the watch is more durable. It's also more water resistant. Gab claims it's the most water resistant kids safe watch out there. Uh, but we still don't recommend that you take it swimming or in the bathtub or shower. Also, the number of contacts allowed, the Gab Watch 2 only allowed for 20 contacts and the Gab Watch 3 allows for 100. My favorite thing about the Gab Watch 3, the best upgrade in my mind, is the, the speech to text and the keyboard that allows kids to text whatever they want. Uh, the Gab Watch 2 didn't have that, so kids could only send preset text messages or a recording of their voice to parents. Um, my kids are really liking this new version better because of those uh, speech, to or speech to text and the custom text messages that they can type themselves. Overall, the Gab Watch 3 is an excellent product. It's a great way to make sure your kids are staying safe, that you can keep track of them. I love the uh, option to see where they are at all times uh, and to know that they can get a hold of you if there's ever a problem.